growth for disc golf is just booming. And, and people coming into the sport today are coming into the sport by playing disc golf. They're not right. coming in. They're not coming into the overall like I did. I mm -hmm. played freestyle and all the events. And, and that's the downfall of people not realizing that there's so much out there that mm -hmm. they can actually do. Like coming up to the overall, you still have to throw distance like in golf. So distance is a major factor. Accuracy is a major factor. So, and those are all events that can be in, in, entwined into the overall so that we have a yearly overall champion. I didn't transition to dominate women's disc golf. Right. I'm 63 years old. That's not going to happen. You know, these girls are half my age and they're just, they're better or, you know, um, so on that end of it, I, you know, that's not why I transitioned. I transitioned mm -hmm. because I knew at a very young age that I felt different. It was a life struggle through most of my life. And, um, uh, you know, most people later in life that have, you know, fought it for most of their life, they end up trying, you know, it, there comes a day where maybe it, you, you want to do something about it. And, and mm -hmm. basically that's what I did. When you, when you can be your true self, employers are going to be more productive. Yep. So, mm -hmm. I mean, it's, you know, and, and believe me, I became more productive. Yeah. I, I, oh, for that sure. was one of the reasons why I, you know, tried to get things done with and make Delta, you know, understand that this is going to be good for you too.